Right now, oh, my correct people, Kabiesi said he wants to let everybody that is giving him trouble off the hook. You guys remember I told you guys that Kabiesi have not divorced this woman. Take it to the bank and cash out. Kabiesi did not divorce any of the women. If you think I'm lying, go to the palace and find out. This is what I used my two leg and I went to the palace to find out. He only relegated them to the Olori quarters. But hypothetically, they are still his wife's 100%. Hey, oh, do be shoot bad, mama fly you. The more you people see, the more you people understand. Kabiesi have already mastered the game. Kabi and C have mastered the game and it's okay. You people want to hear that they are divorced, Abi. Let me tell you people that they are divorced so that everybody will rest. If not, make it make sense. What is the difference between you have divorced somebody and the person is still staying under your roof? It doesn't make sense. Make sense. It doesn't add up. But they say, oh, anyway, oh. no, it's more matter. So right now, Olori said he's tired that let Miriam come and go, especially Miriam and Ashley, that the rest, he can manage them, that he want to do it badge by badge, that he's tired. And let me tell you guys what you guys don't know. Anytime Miriam commits an offense, and an anytime Arian, Miriam knows that he commits an offense against Naomi, he knows that KBSC is going to get very angry. Miriam will start begging. Miriam will roll on the floor. Before you know, Miriam will run to own, he will run to go and call her family. As I am talking to you people like this, they said Miriam family members are in the palace. Yes, the Miriam family members are in the palace. Doing what? Begging for Miriam. Every day they'll be begging for Miriam. Every day they'll be begging for Miriam. Ah, ah. Hey, hey. Oh, boy, I know it's more matter. When I heard this particular word, I said, now waiting. Miriam, now waiting. Gone, gone, gone. Hey. Now, Kabiesi said they should go, that he's tired of them, that they keep messing up his life at every given opportunity. They will mess up his life and they will bring his life down. So, hypothetically speaking, that Kabiesi called Miriam's family and he called Ashley's people and he told them they should come home. That he's not there, that he's, he's even trying to do divorce, go through the legal process, that right now he does not want to do it. That he wants to do it badge by badge. That they should come and carry Miriam and go. He wants the old palace to know. No be smart, you know. He called them out that what is it, that what Miriam did today is unacceptable and the one Ashley has been doing before. And what even make me got angry is that they say when he was talking the thing that the people were not even, the way they were looking at him like, are you serious? Is it not you? That kind of looked and, and it's very, very annoying. I don't think KBAC deserved that. KBAC deserved to be loved. And at the same time, I still think KBAC deserved justice. Justice for KBAC because the way these women are doing KBAC anyhow, anyhow is not sweet. Hey, hey, this is nonsensical of the other of the of the other number one these women don't even have children for kbc so why is kbc doing as if they love is tie and die eh even if it's tie and die they tie you these people are the one enjoying you they are bringing you down at every given opportunity they are using rope to tie you at every given opportunity you are not having a express you express yourself you are not with queen naomi the way you want at the end of the day the essence is only want to be loved and be loved in return. But it's not seeing this love. So only is telling Miriam's family, enough is enough. I am tired. They say Miriam's family was busy in telling KBAC, eh, when you came to Maria, we told you if you go fit, you say you go fit. So only was pre-informed about Miriam. So I heard that they told only you go fit, only saying go fit. That look at it right now. Only not fit. Now don't they run kitty kitty, run kata kata, no fit drink water drop cup. Eh, weleke. KBAC is saying that these women are messing up his life. They are messing up his life so, so much that he doesn't even know where to start from. He doesn't know where to stop. That if he does not stop these women now, these women will take him to where he did not know. And these women will drop him there like it's hot. But right now, me, I'm saying that KBAC, nobody is messing up your life. I just feel you are the one messing up your own game. I just feel you are the one messing up your own life. If you look at it hypothetically, if you look at it very, very well, KBAC is the one setting himself up for drop and drag because this woman first first no send you you're supposed to know by now that this woman they don't love you people that love you will not do the kind of things this woman does people that are there for you will not do what this woman do these women are just there to bring you down and they are bringing you down at all means it's just that you you are not seeing it but the earlier kbs's eyes is open and he see what every other person is saying 
at that point, nobody will even need to remind him to tell him, push these women away before he push them away. Yes, I said that with my full chest. Kabiyasi's eyes need to be to be open. Enough of this begging. Enough of this sorry. Enough of, it's not me, it's not me. It's the other person. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Kabiyasi don't need all that. What Kabiyasi what Kabiyasi need right now is to do the rightful. That is to do the needful. And that is what we bloggers have been shouting. We've been lamenting. And Kabiyasi is not seen. Kabiyasi is saying that it's no longer possible. It's no longer possible he tolerates their SSCs. That he has tried to keep quiet. He has tried to endure. He has tried to even hold himself. But it's this like this. He does not think he will be able to hold himself anymore. Because at this point, enough is enough. Right now, they say this particular two Oloris, Miriam and Ashley, that they are complaining that this is a setup. This is a setup that the real trouble, troublemakers are there keeping up, they are keeping quiet, that they are trying to stain their white, they are trying to dent their image, but them, they are not going to allow anybody to win in this battle, that this battle is their own and they must win. Which battle? Kabiesi said he's tired of you people mess up. That you people have stained his white too much. Come and go. Is it that these people are not love at home? I kept asking this question. Is it that these women are not love at home? How can they be driving you people every AK market day? Come and go, come and go. If it is me, I will get angry and go because I am love at home. Do you understand? Ha. Now, wow. Please send the old Lord is packing for the sake of Prince Tade. Ah, uh, he's your nest of king. If you know, you know. The winches that are, are crying, is it the fault of the Ifa wives? The old Loris invited this Mushin Mushin to the house. That's what Kabiesi said. That how will they go and invite Mushin Mushin to the palace? That this is unbearable. This is something he cannot take anymore. They will go and invite Mushin Mushin to the palace before you know palace is contaminated. Who does that? As for me, I am so happy right now that everything is unfolding. Everybody is getting to see how the drama is unfolding. At the end of the day, look at the way God is vindicating Mama, Mama Tade Nikawo. Look at the way God is vindicating Naomi. That's why I told people, know your God and you do exploit. Forget what people say. They will mock you and mock you and mock you. But God is there. Father Lord, keep and Kabi AC strong so that he will keep to his word. If he doesn't keep to his word, this end time of is they will be dragging him down. And thank God he's beginning to see it. As it is right now, KBS said he's tired of the old drama. He's tired of all the back and front movement. Right now, we are all happy at the new development. But I just hope our happiness will not be cut short. Because it's like KBS is an expert at cutting our happiness short. But it is what it is. I know victory is going to be our own at the end of the day. Because that is what we want. What we want is for KBS to be happy. You can't have six. We know that it's not possible you have so many wives and be happy. Except they are pretending. But this one, their own wahala is too much. And KBS does not even know where to start from right now. KBAC said he's tired. He cannot have people that will not respect him. He cannot raise people that can, cannot, cannot raise people that will come and raise rubbish in his house all in the name of family. He's tired. Anyway, they said Ashley family have begged. Uh, Miriam family have begged. KBAC left them there. He said he doesn't even want to see them the next 24 hours. I'm like, 24 hours is small. KBAC, can you just ging, 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 well, well. You understand? See you guys later. Now do where to subscribe, like, comment, and bye for now.